Oh my goodness. Whew. I'm burning up, you guys. Same day. It's Wednesday. I went to Dollar Tree again. I actually got got uh, done with my mom's my mom's trees. I was so glad that my little niece was there because she helped out a lot. And I am really worn out, you guys. But let me. I'm trying to think if I should just do it here or go park somewhere else. Let me go park somewhere else because in case someone needs to park right here by Dollar Tree, I'm gonna move out so someone else can park here, especially if it's, you know, a disabled person or an elderly person or, you know, a parent with kids, you know, where they don't wanna cross over to this from the street or the parking lot, they can come park over here. So I'll just move, get out of the way. So let me, let me get out of the way, you guys, hold on. But I wanna do the Dollar Tree haul now because I'm gonna go home and no, I'm not gonna go home, darn it. I forgot I have to go to, my husband wants some ice cream. So shall we do it here? I think it'll be okay here. And I'll just put a piece of paper on top like I did yesterday. Like I have a piece of, I have something here to do it like this. Because my, it, 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 will, it will get hot. So let me just do it like this. Hopefully I can do it like this without it getting hot. Because it gets hot too fast. And I'm like literally in the sun, like right in the sun. Band and help. Okay, it's a little crooked, so I'm gonna leave my car on. Hopefully, the air conditioning is not too loud for you because I'm burning up. Let me get to the Dollar Tree. I found a lot of new items again. Hold on, I want to get the one with my drink in it. I don't know where it's at though. I hope this is all the stuff that. Oh, here it is. I got one of these. These are really good. I think these are the ones I like to drink. Yeah, sparkling ice. I like to get the black cherry one and uh, I like to do um, like a keto a keto drink like they do at Starbucks but you know of course it's not Starbucks it's just the blackberry I think and then you just put uh, some what is it some um, ha um, some creamer and coffee or something like that oh I think I told you wrong on that on that blackberry thing to make that um drink so it's just, i think it's heavy whipping cream and the blackberry um or black cherry ice like this and something else i forget what it is but this one is cherry limeade and it's good but it's just whew, it's it, it'll surprise you when you when you get to it it's like uh, like a shock like ugh, because it's so it's so limey. <laughs> limey? Does that make sense? Hold on. Yeah, I'm worn out. My husband's like, where are you at? I said, oh, I stopped at Dollar Tree. Okay, I really want to get some ice cream. Can you get some ice cream? I'm like, yeah. Okay, so there's going to probably be a little glare. Hopefully it's not too bad of a glare. I'm looking at it right now, but I guess it could just be... No, there's a glare, but I'll do it maybe like that. There we go. Okay, so let me do this Dollar Tree haul. So, I found some new items again, which is awesome. I'm glad. Okay, I'm get, I got a few things to put in uh, my nieces and my nephews. They're going to be moving to Tennessee sometime next weekend, I think. About a week and a half, whatever. They're going to be moving. So, I figured I have some, some little things at home that I can put in the Easter baskets for them. So, I won't have to spend too much money. Um, but these are the, one of the things I got. I got one of these. What I'm going to do, I'm just going to cut it in half and then put, put in one in... Uh, my little nieces and the other one and my little nephew so I thought that was super cute hold on Let me move it down a little bit so looks like that that was super cute got one of these pop outs take and play since they're going to be in the car for a long time I think this would be perfect for that uh for them so this is a Tonka one like a Tonka truck one looks like that and it comes with four coloring boards, three markers, 24 page fun pad, 25 stickers. Now the markers, probably not a good idea, especially for my little nephew, because he's he's real silly. Like he's he just he thinks like he's six years old, but you know, kids are supposed to be silly, but sometimes he does things that he's not supposed to do, like uh right put markers like on the seat or something like that. So that might not be a good idea. But guess what? 
they won't be with me so that's okay <laughs> and then I got this one for my niece she's um, eight I think and it'll be perfect for she loves stickers this one's Nickelodeon pop outs shimmer and shine looks like this and um, I got her some stickers and like uh, sticker pads and like coloring books for I think it was Christmas and she loved them she was literally just sitting there playing with them and then I figured these were cute for them there's four this is great especially if you have like four kids or even two kids and like I'm gonna do I'm gonna do so I'll put two and two uh, for them this is a great price for a dollar and then I got these I usually get these every year these are just the powder candy and there's eight piece in here so that's great see I can divide them I'm gonna just give them one each and then of course the rest I, I'm gonna give I'm making my my daughters and their boyfriends uh, Easter basket and of course my husband so <laughs> and then so I'm gonna use one of these for my little nephew to put his stuff in there's two bags which is cute super cute and not bad for a dollar so yeah and then I'll have an extra bag for later I got I think I have some of these other ones uh, the other colors at home but I found these crafter square metallic marker this is a blue one and I'm thinking the it's a 1.2 millimeter point so I'm thinking this one's a little oh my goodness it's a fine tip I don't have fine tips I love the fine tip pens of markers, anything. I love them. So I got that one and I'll show the other one in a minute because I don't know where it's at it's in here somewhere. I got one more color because like I said, I think I have um, two other colors at home. So I'm hoping this will work. Now does this work for, yeah, hold on. Hold on, great for card making, scrapbooking and DIY crafts. Okay, cool. You can use on paper, cardstock, plastic, cloth, metal, wood, ceramic, glass, and more. Wow. It's a all-you-can-do pin. <laughs> um, so that's good. Maybe I'll put my little nephew's name on his bag. I don't know. Maybe not. Okay, so they had a lot of new scarves, you guys. Never seen them before. Some of them are called Expressions, Fashion Scarves. Um, I got this one because it's so pretty. And let me just... I'm going to open it up. But they had... I didn't take pictures because... Um, and I didn't even do a video because my phone said it. Uh, I don't have that. I don't have storage or some junk. I'm like, really? So I have to delete some stuff. But it's a fashion one. And they had some other ones. But you guys, uh, this is super cute. I mean, <laughs> you can even wear it around your, your head like a headband. But look at the bottom of this. Like, can you see that? I thought that was super cute. You know what? That might even go with my... I don't think I can take it apart. I, just, I can even wear it now. So it's super cute, and this is the only one I got because you know I might not even wear it, but I just thought it was cute just to show y'all. And uh, it, I, I just can't get over like, look at the beading on here, <laughs> super cute. And then, like I said, they had other ones, um, they had other colors, they had other designs, they had some other ones with some kind of different things on the bottom, and then they just had you know, those scarves that they always sell at Dollar Tree, they have like butterflies and. Sometimes they'll have flam flamingos. They had tons. Like we're talking, so many different ones. But I bought those before, and I don't, I don't even wear them. Like I usually just have them for a while, and then I just give them. So I'm not gonna waste. I didn't even want to waste a dollar for them. But they're super pretty, you guys. Y'all really need to go check it out. Okay, and then I got check these out, you guys. These are little cars. Remember my other video? I showed y'all that Dollar Tree. They're coming up with some really cute Easter eggs, and these are cars. Look how freaking adorable. Um, I got two packs. I don't even know I'm going to use both packs, but I figured I'm going to get another pack just to keep for next year. Oh my gosh, you guys. I tell you, Dollar Tree, you're just a bomb, boy. You are the bomb. And then, finally picked up Natasha's cards because I'm like, you know what? I better get them now. This is for my mom. I finally found her card. That's my mom's for Easter. Of course. I'll put this up here. And then this one's for one. I got three of them from Natasha. That's Natasha's, just like I did for Brianna. Super cute cards. I always say that Dollar Tree has the best cards ever. That one, it's deep, and I got a two, really one cute, really like, you know, like love, 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 love one, you know, and then I got her two funny ones. So I got those, which are so cute. I'm very excited about this Dollar Tree haul, you guys. I really am. I should be heading. I just want to get, to get done with this and then go to H-E-B. My gosh, there's going to be so many people there. Luckily, I just have to get freaking ice cream. Well, hopefully, because they always have something going on at 
at H-E-B. There's always a sale or something, and I'm like, oh, look what's going on, and what, look what sale there is. I'm like, really? <laughs> okay, and then I'm going to go to this bag. Uh, I got two more of these um, um, cotton things, cotton candy things, because I got two other ones, and I had them in my other haul. So I got these two for, um, what do you call them? For Easter baskets or Easter bags or Easter whatever. This, oh, I hope I didn't break that. I got this. This is a great deal, you guys. They give you a lot of the, a lot of lollipops in here. Because you can find some where they have the like the Easter stuff, but a lot of the Easter stuff barely has anything in the bag. So I went where the candy was. This sucker is, this has to be a pound. No, my bad. No, it's not. It's 12 ounces. <laughs> whatever. It's heavy. There's a lot of little lollipops in there. And then let me show you the cuties that I got. That remember these, you guys? They sold these at Dollar Tree before. Okay, but they didn't have, I don't think they had these two different designs. Look at that. Remember these? <laughs> Isn't that cute? Oh my gosh, it's so cute. And I was going to put them back. I'm like, you know what? I don't really need them. But I had them a couple years ago and then they faded out and they broke and all that. But they work great. And here's the frog. And I don't remember having the, I don't remember getting any of these uh, last time. I don't even recall what I got last time. But um, I think they ran out really fast. Look at this one little raccoon isn't it cute so if you're looking for some stuff like that man y'all better pick it up now and these suckers were almost gone look at this one and like i said when you turn on the little thing you know the the sun shines on it their light their eyes light up and they work amazing you guys so if you're looking for those pick them up now because i one of the dollar trees didn't have them this dollar tree did have them hold on i'm trying to figure out how to they tried to wrap them and she, you know, she did okay. But the thing is, I kind of need more of a wrap for these things. So let me wrap them myself. I have, I have, I have the mail here. I'm gonna, cause they're gonna hit each other and break. Um, yeah. So I'm glad I have newspaper. Like I said, she, she meant well, but unfortunately, the paper that she wrapped it in was just a little half a half a piece of paper, and that's not gonna work. And I don't want them to break by the time I get home. So, a little noisy, is it? A little noisy, huh? Well, I'm so sorry, but I have to wrap my little critters up because I don't want them to break. And I usually put these uh, on the where my fish pond is outside. That's where I usually keep them. And I have to keep them where the dogs don't get them because my rattlers, they think... They think that our backyard is, is just for them, you know? They'll they'll take stuff that's not theirs and they'll play with it. And then we'll look in the backyard and be like, um, okay, I think that dog has like, you know, I don't know, like a shoe or, you know, like glasses or something. But they think it's for them and, you know, they think, oh, you know, we can just play with it. And then it'll be done. It'll be gone. Okay, sorry about all that. But let me get you the last bag. This is some cute stuff, you guys. I almost left them. I said, no, no, I have to get them. You're going to love them. Oh, here's some. I bought some more candy. So this is a Crybaby, Crybaby Extra Sour. Ugh, I don't really like sour candy, but this is not for me, so I'm good. Uh, they're sour gum. I might try one. I've tried them before, but ugh, I have a hard time trying to keep that stuff in my mouth. Hold on. I'm missing my pen. Now, where is it? Unless I didn't pay for it. I don't see my other pin. Man. And I'm going to have to look at my... Oh my gosh, my chains just fell all over the place. Wow, what a bummer. Um, real quick, you guys, hold on. Because the other pin was stuck on the side, so I don't even think that she... I don't even think she charged me, to tell you the truth. Kind of candy. Oh, it was up here, let me see. metallic ah no the other one must have stayed there well she didn't charge me for it so whatever that's fine so I had another metallic pin but unfortunately she she didn't see it I guess it got stuck in the like in the slot thing because I remember seeing it I was gonna grab it, and I didn't um anyway so that's all right she didn't charge me for it and then I got this candy here also this stuff that pops in your mouth so I'm gonna try to cut it really I'm gonna be trying to be very careful and cut it so I can put those in the 
my little nephew and niece's bag. And then the last four things I got, you guys, mm -hmm. seriously, the cutest ever. Look, I don't think they make noise, but this is in, this was in the doggy area. And I was going to leave them. I said, no, because my dogs are going to tear these suckers up. They tore up the other stuff that I got them uh, a few months ago. <laughs> they're, they're, within one day, it was like torn up. So it, here's the pizza. Look at this one. Spot sauce. And you know these things cost a lot at Walmart or any of those dog places or if they have them at Target. I mean, they're, they're expensive. For a dollar, you guys, you got to be, I mean, it's just so cute. And I got bark bark bq chips bark bq chips <laughs> looks like that oh this is squeaky toy is it well uh, the squeaky is not too too squeaky this is not a squeaky toy is this a squeaky toy this one's supposed to be a squeaky toy they lied no squeakiness in this one <laughs> Well, that's okay. My dogs don't, don't need any squeaking, squeaking noises anyway. And then the last one is this one. Hopsail. Squeaky toy. <sighs> well, so much for the squeakiness. Only one had it, but that's okay. So, yeah. So, and then it has a rope part, which is perfect. So I got that one. The pizza. This cutie pie here. Yeah, aren't they? They're just the cutest thing ever. I wish I would have got my pen because I really want to try it out, but that's all right. Look at this. This is, if you have one of these dogs, they're so cute. Look at that. It'll be perfect. Anyway, yeah, cute stuff, right? And that's it, you guys. That is it. I hope you enjoyed this haul. I got to go to HEB and buy some ice cream. And thank you for watching, and uh, I will talk to you next time, okay? All right, bye.